You ready? Mm -hmm. Alright people. I can edit this out. <laughs> okay. Alright people. We're here today. We're going to talk about uh, organizing your bait. Uh, all your plastics. All your plastics down here. Because, I mean, it takes up a lot of room. And we're going to organize your plastics. And this right here is going to come in handy right here. Pencil pouches. And uh, you got all this. Now, look. Look, y'all. I'm trying to tell y'all. A lot of this stuff. You got your Bobby Garland. You got your Strike King, your uh, Mr. Crappie, got your Ozark Trail. Don't buy that crap. Um, you got your, your Bobby Garland right here. And you want all your good baits separated from all your crappy baits. And you know, and a lot of this stuff is a gimmick. Now, I'm trying to tell you, now you take your, you, you take your, um, your monkey milk, you can't go wrong with monkey milk. You can't go wrong with uh, blue eyes. You take your monkey milk, you take your uh, blue eyes, you take your, well, I don't know what the heck this is. Well, that's blue thunder. Blue thunder's good, it's almost, it's all right. And then you got your green. You got your green, that's key lime green. And this is the Bobby, Bobby Garland. I'm not getting paid for Bobby Garland. I'm not getting paid for none of this crap. But I'm gonna tell you, a lot of this stuff that you buy is a lot of it's just a gimmick. You get out there and you get what what they bite you. A lot of it's off a of reaction bite. But you get your favorite baits. I mean, you can buy hundreds of baits. I'm kind of talking. Am I talking fast? Am I talking too fast? I'm not talking too fast. Okay. No. Okay. You buy a lot of these baits. But when you get out there, you're only going to use two to three baits at, at every fishing trip. I don't care how many baits you got. You're going to use two to three baits every trip. And you got your monkey milk and your blue eyes. That's your go-to. I mean, you can get them in different brands. Bobby Garland makes it. Strike King makes the, the glimmering blue. It's the same as the blue uh, monkey milk. I mean, it's the exact same. You can't tell the difference. Just a different name. Um, you got you got all this stuff right here. You know, you got your blue eyes. But that being said, somebody says I say that a lot. But that being said, um, you take your best baits, and these are my these are my five ba ba good baits right here. You got your you got your it ain't that one, but you got um it ain't that one, but you got your blue eyes, your monkey milk, you got your green. Yeah, hey, well I tell you what, blue thunder. I like blue thunder. And you know you got your you got your uh, blue grass. You got your blue grass. Okay, you take one of these. You can get these at Walmart for 98 cents. It's a pencil pouch. Pencil pouch. You put them in here. Zip it up. Boom. You got them separated. But now, see, you take all these. You put them all together. Say you fill all this up. You put them all together. Man, you can put a little zip tie in there, and you got them all in organized. You see that? All organized. But All right. That being said... Let's go back to it. Okay, you got your, you got your, um, you, you, you got this. Look at it in here. You got, you got your Mr. Crappie. That's Strike King by Strike King. Mr. Crappie by Strike King. Man, I'm telling you, a lot of this stuff is a gimmick. I mean, they all you got all these different brands. And they're all coming out with the same colors and this and that. Blah, 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 blah. You know, just get what works for you. Get what's work for you. This blue, this uh, glimmering blue is good. It's made by Strike King. It's the exact same as the uh, monkey milk. Exact same as the monkey milk. Then you, you, you got this, I, I can't even freaking see it, but yeah, you got your chartreuse green. That's good. I like it. I, I got certain colors that I do like. Electric chicken, people catch fish off of them. I don't care for it. 
But look, this is the thing of it. You get these pouches, you can throw all your Strike Kings in this. You got all your Strike Kings in there. You know, uh, you got your uh, Panfish Assassin. You know, uh, it's, yeah, whatever. I picked them up pretty cheap. But you know, you get you get all your Strike King in there. Get all your Strike King. You know what? I don't even like them right there, man. I just, you know what? You buy over time, you accumulate a lot of crap. But you go with the you go with the Strike King. You Mr. Crappie by Strike King. <laughs> Mr. Cream by, uh, Mr. Crappie by Strike King. <laughs> it's got the same colors as, uh, Bobby Garland. They just made different. Okay, I like them. That right there is just a waste. These right here, these cream, the tubes, people like them. I don't care for them. You got, you got the curly tail. Now, this is my go-to, catch really panfish, brim, and all that. But everything bite them. I catch more bass off of crappie jigs than I do crappie uh, bass jigs, bass lures. But that being said, like I said, people call that my attention, that I say that I cut a lot. I don't know why. But you take this. Look, you take all these cream. This ain't a cream, but I'm going to throw it in there with it. This ain't a cream. I'm going to throw it in there with it. But you got all these cream, right? You throw them in here with that. Okay, you got all your cream in this bag. You got all your Mr. Crappie in this bag. You got your Bobby Garland in this bag. But now, I got a lot of Bobby Garlands because I buy a lot of unnecessary bait. Don't know why, because I don't use them, because I got about three to four I use every trip. If y'all watch my videos, you would know that. Now, I'm talking kind of fast because I got other stuff I got to do right now. But look, you got your Bobby Garland. Look, check this out. Look at all this Bobby Garland. I don't even use. That's an empty pouch. That's got a little bit in it. But over time, when the fish are not biting, you'll throw everything at them but the kitchen sink. And if you had the kitchen sink, you'd throw it too. But you know, look, you got you got the bleeding shad. Come on, man. <laughs> Who's gonna use that? You, you know, 90% of the time you're gonna use monkey milk, blue eyes, and, and, and uh, key lime green. King lime green is good during springtime because bass hit it, boy, they tear it up. Go, going through that grass. And, and you crop it. And you catch some blue grill, man, blue gill when they hit, boom! And then you got your black, you know, and you got your blue here, you know, you got, you know, black, different ones, and like murky water, muddy water, black goes good. Clear water, you want to go with your monkey milk. You got your pink lip, you got your pink lips, what's that, hot lips? No, that's pink, uh, whatever, phantom, pink phantom, what the heck is a pink phantom? Come on, really? It's like a pink phantom. <laughs> That's black gum. Black gum. Come on, man. Who comes up with these names? I bought this stuff. I don't know why I'm wasting my money on it. You know what I mean? Seriously. You know, you look at all this junk. I waste a lot of money on this stuff. That's blue eyes. I got to put that in another pouch. But that being said, that being said, <laughs> but look, I'm putting all this in this pouches, right? Boom, that's not a Bobby Garland, but I'm just getting it out of there. Because you got some pouches that you you do use, and some you don't use. These right here, I will use these over time. Let me put this in this pouch right here. I know I'm long-winded, and I am talking, but I'm trying to explain to y'all how to uh, organize y'all's bait right here. This is, this is the go-to bait right here. Go-to. This right here, this right here is your, uh, when you want to throw the kitchen sink at them. This is your kitchen sink right here. Okay. This right here, this is, uh, Mr. Crappie. I'm going to throw that in there. All right. You see how I'm organizing this, y'all people? See that? Look at that. Boom. 
Alright, I ran out of pouches because I got too much plastic. I ran out of pouches. Okay. Okay, but then you got your pouches for your, um, you know, you got your hooks. Hooks. I did have another pouch. I had another pouch for my cords. I had a pouch for my cords, but obviously I got too many plastics. You buy too many plastics and you never use them. Come on, honestly, look at your tackle box and you would say, wow, I never use them, but I'm gonna save them. I might use them one day, but you never use them because you only use three to four baits, two to three baits every trip. Um, but what I was, the whole thing of the video is that this is how you organize your thing. You get your, you go to Walmart or Dollar Tree, Dollar General, you pick you up some of these pencil, pencil pouches, you can organize this stuff. You keep everything organized. And that way you can even strap them together with a zip tie and boom, look at that. Saving room, buddy. Saving room. But I got so much stuff right here, um, I'm gonna need more pencil pouches. Cause I overbought stuff and I don't even use them. All right, that being said, I will see y'all on the next one. Boom. Oh, hey, and, and hit the subscribe button, tell your friends about it. And uh, the next video, I'm going to show you how to string up a Black Max. Black Max reel right here, bait caster. Um, you can actually crappie fish that, bass fish, catfish with it. You can pretty much do everything with it. All right.